These are the Continental Vanco camper tyres, specific for motorhomes. They came with my motorhome. And just to show you some of the things to do with it. So this is the size, side rating. Um, we've got the special instructions. The important thing on most, you'll get something like this. This is the date stamp, 15th month of 18, 2018. It's just next to the homologation mark there. So look for something like this that gives you um, a time when they're built. So that's a 2018 tire. As you can see, rubber's still nice and shiny. Everything looks okay. However, if you look in the grip, there's some cracking in there. Now, that's nothing to worry about. It's just surface cracking, but it's something you should monitor. I will just take you to the rear tire. And the reason I want to show you this, now these I've never touched a curb in 45,000 miles. I've never ever touched a curb with them. However, this is a 2014 tire. Week 48, 14. And just look at this sidewall. Don't know whether you can see. It's looking very worn the rubber you can see it on the here as well same tire 2014 this came with the van do bear in mind i bought this van in 2016 new the tires were already two years old the other important thing with your tires is the tires got a, a load reading on it it's here look don't know whether you can read that. It will tell you the maximum load for a single and the maximum load on a dual in kilos and pounds. That needs to be uh, right when you get your tyres. If you need to check the weights of your motorhome before you get your tyres, just come inside and on mine, it's there, look. The plate's there, it tells me what it is. If you're hoping to go to Europe in your motorhome and you're hoping to cover the winter months, a lot of countries either require snow chains or they require you to change your tyres they would have to be mud and snow tyres or they have to have a specific symbol on the side that show there for winter use. So please bear that in mind as well if you're buying new tyres. Think where you want to go with them. If you're just in the UK, you're going to be fine with the standards. If you want to go to Europe winter months, please ask, go on the RAC site, go on the AA site, have a look. It will tell you all the information you need to know. But don't waste your money on summer tyres if you're going to Europe in the winter. Please get the right tyres for how you're going to use your vehicle. So that's just a quick rundown. I put a couple of photos of uh, the special parts of the tyre. But please be aware, um, you should really have motorhome tyres. Commercial tyres are okay as long as the rating, i.e. the rating down here on the sidewall is correct. I would never use car tyres. Um, I don't think they're safe for a motorhome, but some people do use them because they're cheaper.